Hey, I'm telling y'all, this right here is a sneaker that's gonna be making y'all some money by the end of the year. Stay tuned for the rest of the video, man. What's going on, YouTube? Thanks for tuning in to today's video. We got something very, very dope in this box right here. Definitely wanted to bring it to you guys and put you on because this right here is a sneaker that's gonna shoot up in the resale market and it's definitely gonna be a great sneaker investment by the end of 2022, man. If you guys are new to the channel right now, what I need you to do right now, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell for your voice, you don't miss out on any other content that we drop. This year, like I said, I'm gonna help you guys out with all restock, shot drop, exclusive access, and of course, some sneakers that I think have some great potential on the resale market in this year, 2022, man. So these right here, Definitely could see these things going crazy by December time frame, especially by summertime. So we're gonna be talking about this sneaker and what you guys let me know how you feel about it down below in the comments. Before we get into this unboxing, I need everybody right now, hit the like button and make sure you drop a comment down below. Let me know what are some good sneakers to invest in in 2022. All right guys, like I said, I got super lucky with these right here, man. So one of my dope, Dope supporters, one of my dope people that, you know what I'm saying, that really helped me out on the channel, said, yo, I got exclusive access on these Air Jordans right here, and uh, they didn't want them, they didn't want them, and they literally hit me up and said, do you want this exclusive access? I said, no doubt, I'm like, yo, let me get that, I send you the bread, and they let me get it for retail. They could have charged me what these are going for in the resale market, but no, gave it to me for retail. I really, really do appreciate it. So we can get right into this unboxing and uh, show y'all what your boy got blessed with, man. Shout out to the Vintage Squad that really hold it down for your boy, that help your boy out. And I, it's really greatly, greatly appreciated. It's not going notice. And that's why we're gonna be doing more giveaways on the channel because you guys really look out for your boy, the Vintage, man. So let's get right into these. I already see the box. And once y'all see these, y'all gonna definitely feel where I'm coming from as far as the resale market, what it's going for now, and the upside this sneaker does have. So you guys see it, an Air Jordan 4 box. Let's throw that out the way real quick. Whew. Another Air Jordan 4, man. You guys see it with the flight up top right here. Now the official size tag reads, Air Jordan 4 Retro Black, multicolor, multicolor. Got these joints in the size eight and a half. You guys should know what it is. Hey, let's get right to it. Let's get right into it, and yes sir, yes sir. Shouts out to the Vintage Squad, man. We got another pair of the Air Jordan 4 Red Thunders, man. Crim Crimsons, whatever you want to call them. And these right here, I feel like is one of the best sneakers to invest in in 2022. Luckily, like I said, I got these for retail. I did want to double up on these, you know what I'm saying? Because I really want to beat this pair up, throw a couple of dope fits with it. You guys already see up top, and we got the Unknown Collections cap on. It goes perfect with this nice Air Jordan 4 black and red colorway, man. So I feel like any black and red colorway that Jordan uses for silhouette, it's going to do numbers. People really love the black and red color. And um, these right here has Air Jordan 4. The Air Jordan 4s are really what's been popping lately. Like, just check out the Air Jordan 4 Lightnings. Check out these, the Black Cats, the Air Jordan 4 Cool Grays, even the shout up to like five, 600 bucks in some sizes. You guys go check all the recent Air Jordan 4s we have gotten and look at the resale prices. Even the Air Jordan 4 Fibas is going for over $350 right now. You probably don't even know what the Air Jordan 4 Fibas are, but go check some of the past two years, you know what I'm saying, of Air Jordan 4 releases. You guys gonna see what I'm talking about as far as the resale value in these sneakers right here. So for these Air Jordan 4 Red Thunders, there's a lot of issues with the you know quality control. And I definitely see this pair. So my other pair, I'm gonna grab it real quick, but this pair right here has some scuffs, it has some bruises, you know, it's too big expected. But it was a lot of people that was mad about what Jordan Brand did with the quality control on these. A lot of dust, a lot of dirt, a lot of glue stains. But hey, it is what it is. You're gonna rock the sneaker, you're gonna get it dirty anyways. And uh, a lot of people, like I said, was very, very salty about that. Oh, so let me go ahead and grab the other pair real quick. Peel this side out. I think this is a size nine. So yeah, the pair that I got from Foot Locker, I think I got from Champs actually, got in a size nine. And uh, we already did that review on feet on these things. Make sure you guys go check that out. But we also have that size eight and a half, man. So I usually go true to size usually with my Air Jordan 4s, but eight and a half is good. 
down to half a size, up half size. I don't really think it matters with the way that the Air Jump 4 is built. So the pair that I got from Champ Sports is in the middle, and then the pair I just got from the Sneakers app, you guys could tell on the outside of the pair I got from Champs, and the, and the pair that I got from Sneakers app has a lot of scuffs on the toe box all around the outsole of the sneaker, and I don't know what that's about, man. Straight from the Nike warehouse, and that's just how they did this, man. I do know for sure that these shoes are made in different factories, and that's probably what the major issue is. Different factories are producing the sneakers differently, storing them differently, and stuff like that. But it is what it is, man, at the end of the day. So like I said, man, the Air Journal 4 Crimson, aka the Red Thunders, are probably the best sneaker to invest in in 2022. Right now, they're sitting right at 300 bucks. I'm telling you guys, just look at the Air Jump 4 Black Cats, look at the Air Jump 4 Cool Grays. You guys will definitely see what I'm talking about as far as the trend lately with Air Jordan 4s. And this is the black and red colorway, man. That red colorway people love. And I definitely think that you guys should invest into the sneaker while the resale is only sitting around 300 bucks because it's going to continue to grow and it's a lot of upside with these Air Jordan 4 Red Thunders, man. Again, shouts out to the Vintage Squad for throwing your boy a huge lob on getting another pair for retail. I'm going to sit on this pair right here. Definitely going to keep two pairs because I want to rock the hell out of this sneaker because I think it's a very, very dope, unique colorway. And like I said, I don't think it's too many sneakers this year that's coming out that I really, really like besides a couple of those OG colorways we're getting back this year. Hey, real quick before I let you go, we will be doing a full review and on feed over the Air Jordan 1 Dark Marina Blues and these Air Jordan 6 UNCs very, very soon. Hit the notification bell and make sure you subscribe so you know when this video drops, man. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel right now. If you're new, make sure you hit the like button as well. To go for every video is 500 likes, man. So I hope your boy out so we can continue to grow on the channel. And let's hit that 100K by the end of the year. Make sure you guys go follow my IG and my Twitter down below. As soon as I see anything about restocks, shock drop, exclusive access, I usually retweet it or throw up on my story. And make sure you go check out the clothing brand Unknown Collections, man. I will leave the website and the clothing brand's IG down below as well in the description box, man. I appreciate all of the support. Thanks again for tuning in. And with all that being said, I'm gonna catch you guys in the next video, man. Peace.